Oh, that was my setup for a second. Just kidding. Nah, these people, those people know what's up. That's funny, because, uh, he really does have my setup right now, so I let him borrow it to go get this 240, which he actually bought from an acquaintance of mine. And it's a real project car, you can say the least. To say the least. Let's go check this some bitch out. Tell which house this is. Uh, you had to buy one more car. Just one more car, they said. <laughs> I can't believe he bought this thing. I know. This is gonna be the car that costs you the most money, you realize that. I do. I the cheapest do. shit to buy is the most expensive in the end. Look at this thing. Nothing. A cage and a bare chassis. And I guess... Some shit. <laughs> some shit here. I, who knows if you're gonna use any of that. That'll, gr that'll probably get grenaded in like... 30 seconds. It'll get welded and then grenaded. It'll be fine. I think, by the way, I think my damn thing ain't welded no more. You unwelded it? I think she came unwelded. Alright, well we can always re-weld it. <laughs> yeah. I think it's gonna be... This thing. That's gonna be quite a lot of work. Train. He's not gonna put it in here. We got another one. This 14 is a lot nicer car than this. Yeah. This thing's got a really nice clean interior though. Now he says 14. Yeah, this is. This thing's freaking nice. Cool for 240 especially. Got, I don't know what you call those body kits again. I forgot what they call them. But it's clean. Yeah. You know, the funny thing about that big old square body that he's got there, cool truck, but every time he has to tow something, he has to borrow one of my Fords. 